Hello and hi. Today we are not going to play store for apps but rather using the inbuilt settings which you rarely use. They are helpful and you will like them. With that being said, let's get started. The first setting we are going to check out is smart lock. First let me take you to smart lock then we will check out how and what it is. So these are the various methods you can use to lock your device. It's not just fingerprint and pattern lock. It has many modes as you can see and it uses bluetooth connections, trusted locations, when you are carrying your device with you or when it recognizes your face or your voice. It is good and all but not highly secure when compared with fingerprint or pattern but do give it a try and it feels fun and high tech so if you don't already have it then please give it a try. Next we have speed dial. When we had those old phones with keyboard we used to assign specific contact to specific keyboard numbers for quick dialing. Remember those days? You can do it too but with a twist. You don't need to assign a number but place the contact on the home screen that is on your display. If you contact the same person regularly say your parents you can always place their contact on the home screen. And it's quite handy to use. If you want to use T9 keyboard styles speed dial then you can do that too. Just go to phone dialer, press and hold any key then it will notify you for speed dial then assign a number to a contact. The next setting we can use is lock apps in multitasking. We have that urge to swipe or clean the background process by swiping the apps of the multitasking window and in that we close the apps which we use. This can be stopped and there is a simple solution. While in multitask window, you can see the lock icon, click on it. That will stop the app from being removed by swiping. By the way, if you like this video, till now then please hit subscribe. Now with other uh, rarely used app that is printing. I have never seen anybody use this setting on your android but you can use it in other way there is no strict and hard rule to use it only for printing you can save web pages in pdf format with that that's right in pdf format so if you have some important notes that you would like to have but uh, can't find the save as pdf option to save it into your phone to read it later or have backup then use these settings. For this you need chrome browser, open it, then browse to pages where you would like to go, then click on share, then click on print. This will open the print setting with the preview of the page and you can also select the number of pages you want to save. Then on top change from select a printer to save as PDF. Then click on the PDF icon and download it. And then select the storage and name the PDF whatever you want and save it. So that's how you can use your printing setting. So the next setting is lock screen message. This is simple and effective way to inform someone without opening the smartphone.
से यू हैपन टू बी इन एक्सीडेंट गॉड फॉर बिट नथ इन बैड हैपन बट हैपोथेटिकली से इट हैपन देन पीपल कैन यूज दैट कॉन्टैक्ट विच यू सेव ऑन लॉक स्क्रीन टू कॉन्टैक्ट द नंबर प्रेजेंट ऑन लॉक स्क्रीन इट कैन बी यूजफुल इफ यू फॉर गेट यूर फोन समवेयर इन द स्टोर और इट सम अदर प्लेस द पर्सन कैन कॉन्टैक्ट द नंबर दैट यू सेव ऑन लॉक स्क्रीन यू कैन राइट इन केस ऑफ एमरजेंसी कॉल सो एंड सो पर्सन सो दिस विल बी हेल्पफुल The next setting is of magnification gesture. This is an accessibility feature. If you have a weak eyesight or have specs and sometimes it difficult to see something at that time this feature comes in handy. If you triple tap on the screen it will zoom. It does not need to be only in browser or images. It works on every screen. last for today is developer options many of you already know what this is but few might be new to this this is for them this option is not uh, provided by default you need to tap on build number 7 times then developer option will be available and then uh, you can check out other options available there or check any other video how you can use developer options If you have some features like these then please comment this is me Satish signing off see you in next video